What's up, people? Welcome to my YouTube channel here at uh, Virgo Goddess Medium. This next general reading that I am about to do is going to be for the sign of Taurus for the last week of March. And so, um, basically, this reading is going to be um, dealing with uh, Taurus and their person, okay? And so, for my Tauruses... Some of you are uh, using your intuition when it comes to dealing with a, a lover. And so um, this can either be in the past or this could be very recent where you are in a situation with someone, Taurus, who um, pretty much kept secrets from you. This person could have been a little bit of um, emotionally and mentally and verbally abusive toward which you trying to um, use words to put fear in you. Um, every time you turn around, this person was always keeping you in conflict where one thing would lead to another. And because of the secrets that they hid from you, it caused some type of a tower moment between you and them that kind of blew out of proportion. Um, kind of in a situation where the situation was draining in itself because the situation um, caused you to lose sleep. The situation had you feeling stuck. The situation... Had you feeling trapped. This situation between you and your person, Taurus. Um, this person betrayed you and stabbed you in the back multiple times. This person kept you in three, four party situations. Um, this person caused you to uh, pick up and leave. Because you got tired of dealing with the situation. So therefore... You got to a point where you was just like, you're ready to put an end to all the conflict. Um, you got to a point where enough was enough. And um, the situation in itself caused you to leave and not want to look back. Um, This person, this situation that you were going through with this person was like a burden. And you found yourself wanting to uh, release this burden. And because of how this person made you feel, Taurus, um, having to leave the situation, not want to look back, um, this person made you to the point where you just got tired and stressed out and overwhelmed and just said enough is enough and just, you know, take the easy way out and you just want out. So your leaving caused you to become guarded to the point where you no longer trust this person. And so you shut the door where this person is concerned. And since you uh, shut the door, either you or your person is constantly, I want to say, your person may be grieving you and missing you and thinking about the times you shared. Or you could be thinking about the times you shared, but you kind of made up your mind. And um, or this person is wanting to uh, be with you, but because of all the damage that was done between you and your person... Your person is feeling as if they can't have you. They can no longer have you. And so um, now your person may be trying to, you know, drink away their pain by now saying, okay, well, if they can't have you, then they'll just try to move forward and try to look at other options and see what their other options are, or see what kind of options they may have that's out there that may be available. Meanwhile, you got the door shut. You're not trying to let them back. And your person is kind of going through some type of karma of their own. 
for the way they treat people in the past and those people who they hurt in the past. So your person is kind of dealing with some karma of their own. And so um, as of you, as of today, you have kind of overcame all this where now you have become the queen of wands. And so um, you're pretty much sitting on your throne, you know, you're moving forward. You don't wish to look back to this situation because it was so toxic. And so, um, some of you may have a family with this person where you may have a child with this person, you know, and, um, this person is wanting to kind of like put their family back together, you know, the kids, the dog, that sort of thing. And this person is like wanting to have a ten of cups with you, but they are aware they messed up. So, Taurus, you're just kind of working on yourself while leaving the door shut on this person and this situation that you dealt with that was kind of toxic. And um, for some, Taurus, either you could have been dealing with multiple people or the person who you was involved with was dealing with multiple people. Because you have um, all your signs here, are here. You know, you have your cups, you have your pinnacles, you have your swords and your wands. So, um, you know, it's like, let me see what we got. Yeah, you just pretty much got the door closed. And you, Taurus, may be keeping your options open and just kind of like, you know, drinking away the pain and saying the hell with it. And just kind of, you know, looking at your other options that you have that's in front of you now. And you're kind of over it at this point. You're just kind of over it. You know what I'm saying? You had the tower moment. Yeah, there was some secrets, you know, there was some lies and deceit and betrayal. But um, at this point, you're just kind of over it now, you know. The door has been shut. And I don't really see you wanting to look back to this situation. You're kind of throwing the towel on, said enough is enough. And you're now ready to just come out of conflict. You know, you're done dealing with um situations that had you feeling as if you was being stabbed in the chest. You're tired of dealing with situations that cause you to lose sleep. Situations that, you know, tried to put fear in you. You know, you're just pretty much trying to walk away from all the negativity. And you're wanting to somehow restore back faith into your own life. And put back some type of positive gain back in your own life. You know, then there's some of you who may... um where you may be tired of living a toxic lifestyle and you're wanting to uh, fix your family where some of you tourists might have been the one who stepped out and, you know, betrayed your person. And so now you're wanting to um, go back home and fix the damage that was done and see if you can heal and repair your family and bring your family back together and just, you know, say enough is enough and you're tired of running around and messing around with multiple partners and you're just ready to settle down with one person and just be one big happy family. And then you have some Tauruses who may be um, thinking about a past person who you want to be with but can't have. And this person is a past lover. And so you can't seem to get that person off your mind. But um, long story short, Taurus, you are like wanting to um, come out of conflict. You're tired of all the um, the disagreement, and you're just pretty much tired of the past lifestyle. So you are kind of seeking change for yourself, and you're just walking away from all the bullshit and not looking back. Pretty much, enough is enough. And that's pretty much the ending of it, you know. You're just ready to start new chapters for your own self and just begin a new path. And you're just wanting to kind of release the burdens. 
and kind of take it from there and see what happens. Okay, Taurus? So this has been your reading for the last two weeks of March.